Ooh, look, 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 look. Look at him. Look at Look at the Sphinx moth going for the Onathra. Look at that. Going for the giant Onathra. Oh, he's hitting it. I bet they just opened. They're night bloomers. There's another one, too. Ooh, we got that red potentilla. Look at that. A lot of nice stuff up here. Look at that fucking Sphinx moth. Holy hell. Look, it's so juicy and big, it looks like a Hummer. You getting a bunch of nectar out of there? That's that's great. They got the Hylis lineata. Such important pollinators. Look at him. Look at that thing. Look, look, he's the size of a hummingbird. Look at that long tongue. He got that long proboscis. He got that long tube he's hitting all those with. He's hitting the evening primrose. He's hitting in the Onothera. Look at it. Look, look, look. Those flowers just open too. Look there, and they're all over too. Look, I touched one of the flowers and it splooged on me. See, it's got that Onothera, the whole whole family owner Gracie's got that viscid thread pollen. See that? It's like pollen that occurs in threads. Literally looks like someone blew their nose. Like the flower blew its nose or blew a load on me. You know, whatever. I don't care. Fuck it, I'll take it. Look at that moth. That moth is really getting it in there too. What a what a cool, weird little insect. I remember being in the Mojave Desert once and just seeing a, a whole parade of the caterpillars. There had to be hundreds of thousands of them marching down a Highway 62. That's uh, nice. You know, I was walking up here. As I was walking up before uh, before the sunset, I saw this Onathra and said, I wonder what species that is. The flower hadn't opened yet. I wonder if it'll be open on the way back down. And sure enough, it did. This flower just opened, and I just saw a giant sphinx moth come and hit it. See, there he is. Look, he's going to town on it. Look at it. Look at it. Okay, get it in there, buddy. Get it in there. Do it. Put those little flies on. They're, they're eating the pollen, too. They're getting something out of it, but the sphinx moths are the big pollinators, and the, even though they got that long proboscis, they still stick their uh, their whole head inside that goddamn beautiful flower. You can see why. Look how long that tube is.